All right, welcome back to Wrath of the Righteous. Uh, the plan this stream is to finish Graybor's quest and hunt that dragon down and rescue the storyteller. And maybe rescue Wolgif after that. I'd like to have him back in the party as part of the A team. Until then, we need to keep Melly in the party most of the time. I need her to do all my trickery checks. So. We need to resurrect Ember as well. Alright. A couple of things before we set out. What are these transition screens being this long? All right, scroll of raised dead and restoration. Grab a few of those as well. Uh, we can get rid of some of these things. I don't remember why I unequipped that. Oh, we'll need that for our roof slide and we find her. I keep those, of course. And this is also good on a roof slide, so hold on to that. I'm not sure what gloves my, my main character currently has equipped. Oh, none! Alright, perfect. Okay, let's find our way out of the city. Uh, check in with Ember real quick. I don't know, again, I don't remember when her sermon pops up. Shit. Oh, that's right, we just used Ray's dead, so. No one stands in my way. I'll try it right now, because it may end up being bugged out. Oh, that's right, we need Graybore. Hell, shoot. He doesn't have levels of trickery, right? He has four. Alright, so I need Socio for Resist Fire Communal. Against the dragon. The Greyboar for the quest itself. Ember is a staple of the party, along with Sila and Wendewag, because my romance option, but it is only for this area, so I think we'll sit. Wendewag out for right now, because I can do most of the damage. We don't need Wendewag. It's a little tough call. But I need someone to pick locks and disarm traps. And since my... My main rogue is a bit of a coward. <laughs> he can't do it. Alright, so we need uh, Alchemist Laboratory. We'll just start with that for now. All right, now we head west. I want to go to Grimwood. Is 
That's not going to loop all the way back to the south, is it? We'll go this way. We need to get back to uh, this other fort. This is currently under attack. A couple of things. Do we have a quicken rod at all? No, I'm pretty sure that uh, Wolgif has our one quicken rod, so. Let's hope our initiative is enough. Ow. Die. <laughs> well, there goes Ember. We just brought her back for that to happen. Of formation, like so. Head on. It's hoping that she would fire breath towards Bismuth, but she still went after my, my party despite uh, targeting Bismuth. Alright, we need another uh, raised dead scroll. Should have bought a couple, like, like oh, I won't need it. <laughs> First fight outside the gate, we needed it. Yeah, always try to resist the, the magic. I probably should have read that. Oh well. This is the uh, demon mythic path stuff. Yeah, so the spell disperses the moment the commander thinks of resisting. A soft female voice says in his ear, I will be back. I hope you change your mind. At these words, the commander immediately falls asleep, his waking consciousness enveloped in the thick blanket of oblivion. Alright, so ask Glass Wall, wall for help. Gives us the Inquisitor Mercenary Unit. We had duelists with uh, Sword Lords. And Sorcerers with Isger's Aid. I think. Because my character's trying to live up to the ideals of the Crusaders. This makes the most sense, so let's go with the Sosu. What an annoying person. I 
I'm not sure how she can go to sleep at night, knowing she has to look herself in the mirror when she wakes up the next morning. Sure, we'll go ahead and do this. Uh, buy a couple extra. Well, we have raised dead on Social, so I guess I don't need to buy the scroll. We could have kept pushing forward. But I still probably need more restoration scrolls. So we're burning through those very quickly. Run a little low on money. Need to do some adventuring to make up for it. Sila, a ball gown would suit you very nicely. Or any dress. Are you kidding? All that lace on me? <laughs> It'd be like putting a saddle on a sow. It'd be enough to make the cats laugh. I don't know, Wonderwag may not find it funny. Yeah, so this is the same thing we saw before. Now, the commander's dream is interrupted once more by strange magic, but this time everything is different. Previously, the spell tried to snatch up his body and bring it to the summoner by force. This time, however, it envelops the commander softly. The spell draws him in tenderly, like a loving embrace, inviting him to go on an amazing journey. The commander decides to inquire as to who is summoning him. The commander's ears are filled with the rich, musical sound of feminine laughter. Images of the past appear before his eyes. Hepsimira's prison, gloomy, unlit walls, a cage with a strange lock, and a shadowy figure hiding nearby. Its silhouette looking, or sorry, looks vaguely feminine. In the commander's head, a female voice whispers softly, I am a friend. The commander decides to succumb to the beckoning force. In a corner filled with shadows, a little patch of darkness is born, no larger than the head of a pin. It begins to grow, drawing closer to the commander, then it seems to leap at the commander's face, swallowing him whole. The commander sent flying through the emptiness of the void to meet the spellcaster who has summoned him. That's what a uh, animate uh, skele or animate dead is for. It's for zombies. Because it's raised dead is different than uh, the necromancy spells that bring just the body back. I don't think the soul's back in the body when it comes to necromancy, right? Or it's four spec. Where raised dead, it's it's a willing revival. Hey, already got a midnight bolt. Cool. Oh, there's something new. Book grants a plus one insight bonus on knowledge arcan arcane skill checks. Cool. That's one of my primary skills, so that works out. You always find that there?
Yeah, I mean, there's ways to bring people back as zombies, so that's still an option. Alright, I probably don't want to try to make this check yet. Because I don't really have knowledge world invested into. And we'll let us go outside. Hey, Baylors. Move out. Probably a little early to be taking you guys in a fight. Well, we fought one already, but with the party. Greetings, mortal. Hello. I was waiting for an opportunity to meet you in person. During our last encounter, I could not appear in my true form due to the circumstances. I did not want to risk falling into Baphomet's clutches. Here, in my palace, we can talk more comfortably. Why did you help me escape from Hepsimira? Baphomet is no friend of mine, and his insolent spawn has done nothing to gain my favor. You, on the other hand, seem very promising, mortal. It would be a pity for you to languish in that prison. I expect us to form a mutually profitable alliance in the future, and then you can repay me for your rescue in full. I'm sure she's the nurse that I would want. She's a succubus, after all. Uh, why are you interested in me? You are very talented. You are strong and resolute. And you know how to lead others. The moment you joined the game, the stakes changed. The defeat of Galarian, although slow by mortal standards, was once inevitable. Now, however, it is far from certain. You must admit, it is only natural for me to be curious about the person who has tipped the scales from their delicate balance. How did you pull me here? I summoned you. You are a demon. And demons respond to being summoned when the appropriate spells are performed. Normally, I would use such spells to summon those who have angered me, in order to make them face judgment. However, today is a far more pleasant occasion. I have invited you here to make your acquaintance. Well, that's also not true, but Camellia is very much not nearly as bad as Nocticula. At least... Old oh, Nocticula, she does get better. <laughs> uh, where are we? We are in the Abyss, mortal. In my realm, the Midnight Isles. This is my palace, and this city, Alushinira, is my capital. You are at the very heart of my domain, and the fact that you have been allowed here is a great gift, and a sign of my favor. I see. And what do you want from me? I have a great appreciation for your talents, but I'm not asking you to serve me. I'm inviting you to be my guest. From now on, you will be welcome in my city, Alushinira. Of course, you are not a prisoner. You will find a magic symbol in the chambers to which you were transported. It will take you back to your chambers on Golarion. If you draw the same symbol, it will bring you to my palace at any time. I ask only one thing of you. Do me the courtesy of not killing my servants. At least, not the most valuable ones. I would also appreciate it if you refrain from traveling to the most dangerous parts of my city. I would be displeased if your life ended because of an encounter with some of my more malevolent subjects. If you run into Hepsimira, I recommend you avoid conflict, because she is unlikely to ever forgive you for your escape. I protected you from any new attempts to summon you to her prison, but I can't protect you from her glaive. However, I will give you a bodyguard. Huh. This is Yaz the leader of my city's Assassin's Guild. He will be taking care of you. As you can see, I value your safety highly. If you want to repay me for my kindness, I do have a suggestion. A person called Arilu Vorlesh came to my city. 
I find her rather annoying, and her presence in my dominion unnecessary. Of course, I'm not trying to task you with killing her. But you are a crusader, and she is the architect of the world wound. I think any meeting between you would have a predictable outcome. If you decide to look for her, Yas will help you. Oh, and one more thing. When I helped you, I saw your potential as a demon and as my future ally. I felt that your heart was full of vice. But it seems I was wrong. It is truly amazing how such a pure soul can belong to a creature associated with the Abyss. I do not approve of such beliefs among my subjects. So I advise you to get rid of them as soon as possible. The kind, decent, and merciful have no place among us. Befoul your spirit to remain in my good favor, and Yaz will monitor your success. So I'm assuming this is based on me being a, a good aligned? But it could also be based on... I may have taken an angel option early on. Uh, where should I look for Rilu Vorlesh? Huh. How should I know? She is a powerful spellcaster who knows how to conceal herself and hide her tracks. I could find her, of course, but right now I'm focused on more important things. That's why I expect you to locate her and bring me her head. What do you have against the Rilu? Her curiosity has brought danger to my lands. She... Let's just say, she found a treasure hidden within my domain. Now, her master's servants have flooded my isles, trying to get their greedy hands on my property. That's reason enough to tame her tongue. Why do I need a bodyguard? I have watched you long enough to know the kind of wild beast that lives within your heart. Your wrath can be destructive, and its howling will easily drown out the voice of reason and caution in your head. My city is a dangerous and troubled place, where many things may awaken your fury. Yaz will protect you from the dangers of Elushinira, and he will protect Elushinira from your volatile temper. Uh, what will your patronage cost me? Perhaps one day you will have the chance to serve me by doing something really important. Perhaps one day. I'll remind you that I was kind to you and will expect a favor in return. But today I expect nothing, and impose no obligations on you, mortal. I have questions, and you might have the answers. Let's see if you can surprise me. What do you know about my powers? I would give much to know the answer to your question. Your powers are very... intriguing. A less experienced observer would suspect that some god is helping you, sharing their power. But I sense that the source of your power is different. Hmm. Uh, what do you know about the immensely powerful demons that have recently appeared on Galarian? Mm, I have noticed their recent appearance. And some of my servants are now looking for the source of their new power. Unfortunately, they have not yet been successful. However, as a sign of my sincere affection, I will share this knowledge with you as soon as it is available to me. Are Baphomet and Discari your allies? Oh, she's not going to read this part. Everything is clear. All right, I don't need your guard. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure I can manage on my own. Nevertheless, Yaz will look after you. Such is my desire. Do not try to defy me. But I appreciate your recalcitrance, mortal. 
I want to take the other option too, saying I didn't owe her anything. I didn't want to do anything for her. Yeah, banish all the goodness and lawfulness from my heart. Pretty funny though. I'm not too worried about him this time around, but uh, on my proper demon run, it'll probably be a lot more fun. But we'll see. We'll probably you know tear through Lucian Ira if they actually let me leave and explore the city. That's pretty interesting. Uh, this early on. He's being fairly candid with us, all things considered. He doesn't have to talk to us, but he's given us a ton of information. And he's being fairly honest with us, too. Which is pretty unlike a demon. Yeah, he's going to transport us where we want to go, but it's, it's still, I mean, we have to go there early. I mean, an articulate this early is pretty, pretty interesting. I guess we met her brother early in the trickster run, too. <laughs> I'm going to talk to you again. Alright, um, yeah, let's go somewhere. I want to walk the streets of Elution Ira. Alright, let's go to the 10,000 Delights. They sound so enthusiastic right here. Now get us there faster than you can blink. Yep, 
Yeah, not impressed, buddy. I was supposed to be doing a completely different quest. Might as well be doing this one right now, but... Supposed to be going to Grimwood and dealing with, uh... Devara? Is that the dragon's name? The thing starts at DV. <laughs> How cool we can see Monago too. <laughs> yeah, get out of here. Head on. That's Shavaro. Yeah, so it looks like we only talked to Shavaro. I don't see any of the other. To go yet. All right, let's talk to Shibaro. Yeah, we still do the wheel check early. <laughs> yeah, well, at least we were in, uh, Dresden when we did this. Yeah, let's look for a Relu Vorlush. Alright, Yaz, protect me. Shall escape. Yaz, where you at, buddy? Let's hear you cry. Yaz! Yaz! Okay, Yaz is not protecting me at all. <laughs> what happened? I'm picking fights with demons. Need to buff up a little bit more. I thought Yaz was gonna teleport in and stop him from killing me, but I was obviously wrong. Yeah, you know, this time I'll be a little bit more ready for it. Uh, let's do the Wand of Mirror image. I can't use it. Dang. I was like, I have this.
Yeah, well, I'm gonna try and be stronger. We'll see how it goes, though. If I try and get this guy by himself, then Rock can hold off the other two, and maybe we can... Shoot, I mean to turn that off. Die! Did he heal himself up? That's unfortunate. Let's hear you cry. My wounds pile on. Yeah, we're not gonna win that fight. Huh. So I didn't think these guys could heal themselves, right? Man, I know this isn't a fight I'm supposed to take, but we have the option to. I want to. Oh, that's right. Gosh, I forgot they had that effect. Thank you. Yeah. Affecting it with a heal spell. So maybe the rock isn't the best idea. Hmm. I think we can do it. We have to get a little lucky, though. And I need to not mess up my blood rage. I actually turned it off and I've exhausted myself. Uh, is there anything else I can cast or equip? We have Fireball. Midnight Bolt would help. A smidgen. Go ahead and activate True Strike ahead of time. I have spells I can cast. What am I doing? Yeah, I don't have a trip ability, unfortunately. I don't think there's any grease spells available, right? Oh, I do have Grease. I can't cast it, though. Alright, well, I have Mirror Image already, so that's fine. Yeah, I'm using Demon Rage. Alright, there's one down. Let's hear you cry! Here we go. Does that take a little bit more time to prepare? Run them through. Boom. Third time's a charm.
See, I didn't take... I didn't think Yaz was that good of an assassin. Granted, when we actually run into him on the regular... on the other mythic paths, you're more than a match for him, so... <laughs> if you don't want me to drown you in the blood of your pitiful servant, start talking. Yeah, Blood Rager's full BAB. I'm fairly certain. It's not like the Magus that only gets uh, medium BAB or uh, about three quarters, 75%. I'm sorry, did I bore you? Alright. Let's get a Nocticulous Palace. I do want to rest up. Yeah, it is full baby. Go back to Glorian and rest up so we have all our spells and summons back. Or summon, I guess. I wonder what happens if we try to execute that guy. Alright, so he gave us a couple of wands. Not our biggest fan. That's okay. Alright, you need to continue back this way. These two guys? Alright. That's true. I can always sell it if I need to, because I have a little low on funds. Like, a, a party's been dying a lot more frequently than they usually do. Uh, I guess we can just go ahead and go this way and try to take out this army. Since we're down here. Uh, 
Uh, we do have some clerics there. Let's get them over here. Oh, and these guys. I didn't even recognize those guys. <laughs> Alright, let's rest up, go back, and we'll do the Battle Bliss real quick. Yeah, well, not yet. Um, we're currently on the Demon Path. You can't unlock the Gold Dragon Mythic Path until Act 5. It's one of the, what, four? Endgame Mythic Paths, or there? No, five. Devil, Legend, Gold Dragon, Swarm That Walks, and, um... Am I forgetting one? You have Angel, Lich, Aeon, Azada, Legend, Devil, Trickster. That's what the original five I was forgetting. I already lost track of which ones I wrote down, but yeah. I thought about mixing it up this time, but nah. <laughs> Now, if it wasn't for that early fight where the uh, enemy general has Scorching Ray and targets your archers, I wouldn't take a caster and I'd try to mix it up. But that one fight justifies taking someone with heal every time. Because otherwise you're going to lose your archers. Unless you wait to do the fight later, which... I mean, I guess you could do. Alright, let's get by the Yaws again. No one stands in my way. So this whole sequence alone makes it feel like the Demon Mythic Path is more tied to the main quest than some of the other ones. Which makes sense. I'm about to grab the, uh... Well, thank you. I'm about to grab the, uh... Dwarven Cup that lets you summon the Azada. You know, it's funny, <laughs> I've got a similar run planned already. I've got the perfect class, the perfect idea behind that uh, entire playthrough already. Okay, yeah, let's uh, use the Demon Mythic Path option. So unleash a storm that rages within your heart. 
and crush the unfortunate demon who provoked your fury. Yeah, let's intimidate him. Hey, we have just enough. Uh, I was thinking the Crusader, a, cr a cleric class who worships Iomade. Let's attack this guy. Cut them to pieces. All right, Minotaur shouldn't be too bad. Well, until they start doing that. So you don't have actually have a chance to pre-buff for this fight. That's a little unfortunate. Oh wow, we're taking an absolute slacking. Hey, we're not gonna win that fight. Jeez Louise. Yeah, so we have to pre-buff before we talk to Yaz and come here. Can't get my summons out, though. So he won't follow us. I need to load back a little earlier. I think with all my buffs, we, we have a chance in that fight. Though the Minotaurs are a little tougher than the ones we fought previously. Nyaz even bragged about how his uh, teleportation is faster than you can blink, so our buffs shouldn't wear off. There shouldn't be any travel time before we get there and speak to Amer Amerngaleth? Amerngaleth? Whatever his name is. Let's go through our potions. I'm not going to be poisoned, but when am I going to use that uh, potion anyway?
Yeah, I, don't know, I think it's more thematic to, uh... I don't know, I like the idea of a devout crusader going in with the, the right eye, like, the, the intention to do good, and then eventually just seeking power over and over again to end the crusade, eventually just succumbing to it, becoming the swarm that walks. It'll be fun. Um, I don't really need any of these. Alright. Y'all, we got places to be. Well, that's the whole, that's the whole point of it, is, uh, he's gonna eventually fall. He's gonna still think he's doing what he, what he should be doing for Iamadae and for the Crusade, but... Obviously, that's not the case. Like, he's gonna believe there's no other recourse but to become the swarm that walks to wrap up the Crusade. One. We're not gonna win this fight. Not this time, anyway. Where's my second attack at? Sorry, we're just gonna save Scum till we win this fight. And my, uh, I did a Let's Play of this, this would definitely be an edited scenario. <laughs> None shall escape! Yeah, this isn't going well. I wonder if I need to go back and get other stuff from, uh... Galaria before we do this fight. What class were you when you did it? Initiative is terrible. I didn't waste time uh, summoning somebody this time, so maybe we've got a chance. Let's hear you cry. Run them through. Nope. That's a lot of damage we just took. Yeah, we can't out-heal that damage. If I got on the fear route, maybe we'd have a chance. Oh, 
I'm going the cleave route instead. That's just not enough. Yeah, I don't know how you're supposed to do this fight at level 10. As a solo build like this. Or solo. Yeah, prepare to fight solo. None shall escape! I'm gonna get close and try and prevent them from charging me. If I get on this side, those guys can't charge me either. The charge is what's doing a lot of the damage. Yeah, we're not. Huh. There's gotta be a way to do it. I don't think I have. Enough buffs for it here. Oh yeah, that's right. I said you were the uh, the raid shifter, which is what I'm gonna play in my demon run. I'll also be a little bit more prepared for these fights, these solo fights, but uh, proper demon run too. Again, we want to get close. Also, cut off line of sight so they can't charge us. They're still charging us, though. Yeah, I man, I'm getting one shot. Like, with, in one round, I'm getting all my health taken out. Maybe when I crit, I have enough damage to one-shot one. So I can't fish for crits either. Yeah, we might be. No, I might just go back to Galarian and grab a few more summons. But then I have to take the time to summon, and my initiative is always less than theirs. So they get the charges off before I get my summons out. Um, I like uh, martial classes. I like any of the strength and charisma based classes. So, Paladin, Blood Rager, uh, Magus. Cavalier. Cavalier is really fun. And also really strong throughout the entire game. Uh, the early animal companion makes the early game very easy. And be able to charge in and one shot the casters in the back line. And then have uh, like greater cleaving finish take out everybody else. It's a lot of fun. None shall escape. All right, so my initiative isn't that bad this time. I'm gonna try to get my summon out right here. Die. Oh, summon didn't last very long, did he? Yeah, it's not gonna matter. We don't have Let's this. Hear you cry. Well, there's a there's a couple fun rogue classes. I think the thug, at least one level of it's fun because it changes any staggered effects into um, sorry, frightened effects into fear. Did I say that right? It's really good for any sort of the uh, if you want to go like Cornigan Smash or uh, Dreadful Carnage builds. Heal me. Quickly. I must have got a second one. Huh. 
There's gotta be a way with what I currently have. I think I just have to get lucky, but... Their attack bonus is too high, I can't, I can't avoid their attacks. Possibly if I keep, uh... Mirror image up, but then I'm not attacking. I need to attack them so I stop taking attacks. None shall escape! Alright, Yaz, if you wanna step up and help out, that'd be great. Not going to, obviously. And that's Here one down. You cry. My pile on. Hmm. Yeah, there's there's no way with what I currently have. I have to go back. I don't have time to summon either before they're on top of me and killing me. But the Azada summon from the uh, Dwarven Mug. It does give you several summons, it's not just the one frog, so that would buy me more time. Alright, let's backtrack a bit. Unfortunately, I hate going this far back, but it's fine. Like, kineticists are just ranged damage dealers, so you build them, well, depending... Depending on which blast you use, if it's energy or physical. Um, does vary a little bit in the feats that you take, but for the most part, it's, it's just ranged DPS. Unless you go, like, Kinetic Knight, then you'll be, uh, using Kinetic Blade and taking, uh, melee feats instead. Alright, so she has my summons. Take that. Um. Good Hope may not hurt. I'll bring the Triceratops. Equip those for now, and... Grab those. Sorry, Bismuth. I'm gonna take one for the team again. Battles await. Pretty common sentiment in games like this. They'll uh, restart Titus. You're not alone. Okay, let's go through here. Let's blur. Don't need bull strength. We'll buff up Bismuth as well. I'm gonna make this work, one way or another. I don't think you can use that. Also, I forgot to give him equipment. I sold some of the uh, pet equipment that I had. I put it onto it. Forgot that he could equip it. And that would help out a great deal here as well.
Alright, I think that's it for now, right? And we'll do the summons once we get there. Hopefully Bismuth buys us enough time to get the summons out. Then we go from there. Hey, how's it going? <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's about to spill those feelings. This is a pretty tough fight, though. Especially when I wasn't prepared for it. I'm a little more prepared now. I don't know if it's going to be enough, but... We'll see. 1300 hours. I haven't broken 700 hours in the game yet. This is my third playthrough. <laughs> okay, Bismuth is up front, right where he needs to be. I think we've got it this time. I've got a good feeling about it. I just remember to put everything back where it goes afterwards. It'd be nice if you got like a uh, stay back here, Bismuth. Materialize! Oh gosh. Well, I had a good feeling about it. You're fine, man. We haven't done a whole lot this stream anyway, so it's uh, more me goofing around trying to solo this fight. And it's not even what we're supposed to be doing. We're supposed to be doing Grimwood and defeating the dragon. Oh no, I can't do that. I'm way too stubborn for that. I'm gonna do it right now. Eventually, maybe. Right, let's make sure his AI's turned off. He needs to take some hits. It also depends on my initiative. Sorry, Bismuth. Die! I see some healing going on. Will it be enough, though? Will it be enough? Woohoo! Six health back. It's more than I had. <laughs> well, it gives you the option regardless if you're good aligned or not. I mean, if you're playing just a, an aggressive demon that's attacking everybody, it would still... It's still into the same thing. Oh yeah, the smite good, yeah. Oh yeah, that's right. That's the difference. Let's make it a little bit more difficult. Alright, hold still, buddy. Oh, my initiative is pretty good this time.
Uh, so I'm not sure why I'm only attacking once per turn now, or per round. I decided to run away to so I could heal up. Yeah, I'm not sure why, uh... Towards the end there, I was only attacking once per round, instead of uh, twice. I think for two rounds or three rounds, I only attack once. I should be attacking twice. Oh yeah, maybe they did stagger me. Let me look at my debuffs when that happens. Figure out why that's happening. Because I may have been able to clutch it out right then if that hadn't happened. I mean, probably not, but maybe. Okay, all right. Let's see what we got going on here. Um, I don't think it's worth using a potion because you just you can't out heal the damage you're dealing. So I just think I just swing and hope for the best. I still have last stand up. Alright, just in case, I'll pop one of these. Oh boy, what a doozy, right? But we got it in the end. A little perseverance goes a long way. I, mean, I could have easily just taken a different option and not done it that way. <laughs> Alright, this needs to go on Wolgif when we get him back. Uh, this will go back on Sosial, and I'll go back on Ember. Uh, where's my extend? The magic rod. This guy. And loot! Oh, it's quick save. Uh, I'm not gonna worry about that. We'll get that later when we come back in Act 4. There's no reason to go back there, but sure. Hey, Hatter. Yeah, being sick does suck. You just watched, uh, well, you came at the perfect time, actually. Okay, um, is there gonna be another fight? Oh, we can search here. Move out. Alright, do we talk to Nocticula now about that? And Yaz isn't very good at his job, by the way. Okay, so it's dead. Go back. Got it. 
Got it, got it. I played the first original Sin, have not played the second one. I never beat the first one, I kept restarting with other co-op partners and we never completed the game. I've only made it to uh, Act 2. I restarted it like three or four times. I'm pretty familiar with Act 1. Yeah, I'm going to be doing Let's Plays of the entire uh, Divinity franchise. I might start at the beginning of next year. Um, there's a few games I want to knock out. I was going to do it after Baldur's Gate 3, but then I was like, I want to knock out a few smaller titles and then a few CRPGs released that I want to play. Uh, like uh, right now, Broken Roads. I want to go back and play Sovereign Syndicate. Uh, Dark Envoy, Svarog's Dream, and there's another one. But after I knock out those few, I'll, I'll start the Divinity franchise. Yeah, I'll be starting with uh, Divine Divinity and working my way through until Original Sin 2. And that includes Dragon Commander. I'm going to play them in order of release for the sake of uh, like Easter eggs and stuff. So you could, I could play them in uh, chronological order. And I have played uh, Divine Divinity a little bit. I don't remember anything past the first town though. I remember there being orcs outside of it and it being difficult. And then uh, I played Divinity 2 Eager Draconis and I completed that. I think there's only one achievement I didn't get for that game when I played through. I don't think I played, I think there's an expansion for it that I didn't play. Yeah, he doesn't. Uh, who's the representative from the Demon Path in the Legend Run? It's not, well, Yaz dies. You can kill him, that's probably why he doesn't show up. And Octicula doesn't show up to help. Mephistopheles does, though, so I don't see why Octicula couldn't. You get Octicula's brother, though. Uh, plus 5% bonus to damage. Sonic Rage. 5% bonus to damage and a minus 2 penalty to armor class. Tormented. Yeah, it has DR1. Yeah, I think Restraint. Because um, my character's trying to find Restraint as well. He will eventually. So I think option 2 is the best one for this playthrough. Oh, does, okay. I didn't remember. I know, like, Ivu, uh, Mephistopheles, um, Articula's brother, whose name keeps escaping me. And, uh... Go on. 
a weird path. I mean, that kind of makes sense. It is the trickster after all. Who knows what's going to happen with that quirky character. Fireball! <laughs> Get murked, nerds. As soon as Shy's in the hizzle. Oh, tacti uh, tactical leader's fun. What do we get here? Braces of heavy hand. Grant the wearer plus three bonus on damage rolls with the offhand weapon when dual wielding, or wielding two-handed melee weapon, for example, a double weapon. Huh, did I use that in my character last run? I should have if I didn't. Fireball! I couldn't tell you. I think the Inquisitor class is fine, though, I don't know, they're a little bit more zealous than I, I like to play. Even with my Paladins, I try not to play the overly zealous character. Alright, uh, let's get out of here and head towards Grimwood. I need to re-equip my items before I forget. I'm going to do a, uh, a, I think a monk for my Aeon run. I'm just not sure which one yet. Alright, uh, Socio gets the Triceratops. Old Bismuth. And Ember is going to be my Pseudo Summoner. Though not full summoner. A uh, bolster? I'll just give her a bolster, I guess. I lead. You follow. Corruption. Yeah, I'm torn between Quarterstaff Master or Student of Stone. So I like the uh, the race specific classes. And usually try to come up with a reason to use them. I, I want to do a Stone Lord Paladin, but I also want to play a regular Paladin and bring Donald back uh, for a future playthrough. But the quarterstaff master, there's uh, quite a few quarter staves you can find, and some, and some pretty early too. Yeah, I think we'll just give them to the. Uh, back to the dwarves. Yeah, really, I think all it gets is a bonus fortification or something, right? <laughs> yeah, Imitator was was pretty bad. Not only do you lose stuff, but then one of the features it says you keep, you can't actually use because of the one one of the features that you lost. You need what? Uh, study target for the capstone feature, and you can't use that because uh, you don't have study target. <laughs> The imitator is pretty. I mean, it's fine. It's a full BAB class, so it's still fine. It's just like a fighter with some extra quirks in it. But not as good as a fighter. <laughs> so you do get the fighter stance, which gives you bonus BAB, so it's still not the worst. All 
I already talked to all these guys too. Move out. Uh, where's Kim Kimoni at? Kenomi. They're rare sight Menda because they're annoying. By annoying, I mean, well, I mean, Nanio can be annoying sometimes. Not as bad as Konomi, though. He takes the cake. Takes the cake from her own birthday party, so no else can have any. You follow. His diplomacy or whatever. I mean, at least change the capstone ability so that he, they can use it. That'd be nice. Because right now, it doesn't get removed from the class, so you think you get it at level 20, then you read the description, and then you don't. <laughs> I like Seal Kind would get along with uh Holbrick. Yeah, straight to the Royal Council. Just an absolute jerk. She's the only uh, council member that like talks back to you. It's like, oh, you can't do that. It's like, want to bet? I'd like to see you stop me. Onwards. Like she's she's my Tristan in this game. Shame you can't banish or execute her in this one like you can Tristan. Alright, so what do I need to do for this quest? Oh, corruption. Let's see. So you just have to change your alignment something you have to do specifically here or can I just work on it by making decisions elsewhere Move out. <laughs> all this waiting bores me Alright, let's try and take care of this dragon. Gosh darn it. Enough getting sidetracked. Yeah, I think she enjoys being the mouthpiece for the council though, so... I don't feel bad for her. And she could say what the Royal Council wants her to say and then like on the side like, oh, you know, you can actually do this if you want. You can actually beholden to the council. You got that right.
I do what I want. Yeah, it's in the name. Oh, by the way, I can stream tomorrow. Just so you guys know. You don't want to stop by and watch me die for 20 minutes straight. Let's move already. Be gone, Save fiend! The last one for me. Hold up. Son of a gun. Fireball. Too late for apologies. It only is worth the pain. Fall. Pile on. What a nuisance. All right. Get up here and take care of this. Into the fray. Pain is excruciating. All right, so we have a healer for. The inheritor, guide my blade. The spirits demand your blood. You sound like right beside him. Go get him. Alright, we got him. Gosh, these ambushes. I don't remember running across these guys in random encounters like that. At least, not this early. I wonder if they rebalanced it. Either way, not a huge fan. But no one died, so it could have could have been much worse. Yeah, I don't remember votaries being in the random encounters. We got those uh, floaty eye guys. No glory without you are today's sacrifice. Simply business. It's your time to cease to exist. A spider too. A jerk. I will bring down the divine wrath. I'll hit you. You won't. I still remember the red mechanic as being this difficult. I mean, it could just be a, a, a bad memory, but onwards. And they seem a little bit more absurd than they used to be. Because the, the Breloos, is that what they're called? The floaty eye guys? Um, they're usually the biggest threat in random encounters. And then after a certain point, they're not a threat anymore. Oh, that's right, I got an army to get past. Uh, we'll get back that way.
Oh, gosh. How many am I getting back? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how much, uh... Reload that real quick. If our archers don't get one shot, then we're fine. I don't know if, uh... <laughs> We can prevent that. Maybe if I... Oh, that's gonna help. Alright, don't want to shot my archers, buddy. Oh, wait. It's not going yet. That's interesting. Yeah, still one shots him. That's a lot of lost archers. That's alright. We have Satuna Shy. I'm not gonna reload that. Actually, I wonder if that connects over here. I could have probably saved some time. But really, I don't need the, the army itself anyway. We have the general, and that's, that's all you really need to succeed. That loops back around this way, I think. So can't quite reach it. I will get to the Ashen Grotto while we're here. Yeah, there wasn't a way for me to stop that though, because the only way it would have worked was if my Hell Knights. Got the morale bonus and got the second turn and I was able to charge that one group of minotaurs and then get lucky and have my archers finish off the other minotaurs in one hit I take out I can take out two units with a fireball but the way they're positioned that's all I could do my will is we resolute. Will win this war I had considered that where we fight all those giants. Oh no. Wrong person. Let's move already. That would have been a good idea. Fortunately, my general does not have shout. No reason. I think some of my uh, playthroughs I'll experiment with other generals and. I mean, I'm safe scumming everything anyway with the, uh, with the streams. I figure out what the awful paths are for a lot of this stuff so I can, uh, goof around a bit more in future playthroughs. 
Oh, yeah, right here he has a plus three. I don't need to waste that on him. Oh, yeah. Me is restless. I wonder why. You can trust me. The goddess protects us. To the restoration lesser first, because it's a longer cast time. We're just burning through our buffs by doing it after we buff up. I try to keep my playthroughs honest, but more so for my let's plays. Uh, my streams, I make a lot of mistakes because I get hasty. The longer, the more, yeah, the longer my play session, the worse I start to play. And it's been like that ever since I was a kid. If I play like short, sweet uh, play sessions, they they always go much better. <laughs> Most of the time, not all the time. Like, we don't need uh, Death Ward for this upcoming fight. I'm gonna cast it anyway. Yeah, I figured they'd all come online at some point. I, I had a ranger general at some at one time uh, that put the traps down. And that seemed fine. <laughs> well, that's fair. It's been a it's been a rough stream. Battles await. We won't fall here. I swear it. Oh, didn't take me out of combat. Wait, what? Oh, they're behind me. Alright, uh, Ember, you need to do something. Start by casting that. Uh, shoot. I forgot about these guys. I'm like, oh, it's just giants. I have to buff up. <laughs> oh yeah, I was wrong. This is one of those scenarios where, uh, we'll have one diamond. I memorizing the game comes in very handy. My will is resolute. Head on! A bright future awaits us. She goes after that. Melia, you come in on this side. She's immediately down. Into the fray. 
Let's hear you cry. Simply business. The spirits demand your blood. I'm all right. I'm all right. The plan. I can still fight. Sorry, so, so you're not supposed to move there. You are today's sacrifice. You stop us. Die. We're in a bad way here, aren't we? Uh, uh. Yeah, I have the amulet on uh, my inventory right now, so that's on me. It's not poison because you can't uh, resist it with the uh, delay poison communal. But I'm gonna equip this other like thing on Ember. Collect myself. Right there. That'll help You're out a little a good bit. Person. I like you. Uh, getting some summons out. All this waiting bores me. Will also help deal with the uh, the swarm, so the target the. We'll make things right. The summons instead. Move out. Soot is restless. I wonder why. No one stands in my way. None shall escape. Surrender, or else! Alright, I'm just hanging back till Ember takes out the six swarms because they are a nasty enemy. Not gone yet, but we can I'll take care of this guy. Open. And Too let Ember keep focusing on them. Jeez oh. Louise, man. Of a main character, so we have to reload anyway. Well, shoot. The summons lasted no time at all. I see. I could use a, a more powerful fire spell, but it's more likely to miss. This war must end. It's like this one. Yeah, because they, it's a guaranteed hit, but they can save with a reflex uh, saving throw. I guess the same thing with Fire Snake. We'll, we'll try Fire Snake. 
My will is resolute. Well? Rely on Let me. Let me help. Let's move already. Ha! All right. You're a good person. I like you. I'm losing my temper. None shall escape. All right, perfect. Quick save time. Die! Try and take this guy out real quick. And Ember, you focus on the swarms when they show up. Like right there. Nice. Simply business. Too late for apologies. I'll hit you. It's your time. I can still fight. All right. Now back to this. You won't stop us. Let's hear you cry. You're in need your assistance. And we did it with one casualty. <laughs> yeah, that would be a good idea. Shame I didn't think of that. The world has suffered enough. Imagine all the bloodshed that we could have avoided. It's been a rough stream for uh, <laughs> for Donatus and the gang. I'm looking for oh yeah, news the oldest. Got me the recipe down. Yeah, well, after enough reloads, anything's possible, right? That's the real superpower. That's the uh, the real mythic feat of the game. But I don't know how he's doing it. It's called Infinite Retries. Now take care, Matthew. I'll be uh, streaming again tomorrow. Hopefully <laughs> with more success. I'm just going to teleport back to Dresden real quick and rest up and bring... We need a uh, Camellia back for lockpicking. Uh, let's go to the temple first. I don't think I'm going to make it to Grimwood tonight. <laughs> I'm trying. It's just not happening. I'm also lacking a proper caster in this party. I mean, we have Ember, but she's leaning into enchantments, not fire damage. Oh, uh, and I'm going to hold it to that. Well, we don't need that longbow, I guess. Nope, don't need all of those, just want the fu- One, two, three, four, five, there we go. 
It'd be a lot easier if uh, Wolgif didn't run away like a coward, but... Then he wouldn't have his redemption arc, so he needed to. Battles await. No one stands in my way. I lead, you follow. Aberdeen. Sorry, Thabardine. You, uh, you had your chance in my last run to be king. No more. Alright, we'll rest up, then continue towards Grimwood. I think Wolgif has one of my Quicken Metamagic Rods. That helps out a lot in the fight against Devara. Devara? The Fire Dragon. Gives your cleric I'm a chance. I'm surprised an odious little lordling like yourself hasn't earned himself a swath of serious enemies. Only people who do things earn themselves enemies. Whereas I, for the most part, simply enjoy myself. It gives your cleric a chance to get, or any caster a chance to get a protection from fire commutal out. Before she starts fire breathing you. Onwards! Alright, we're gonna try this again. Let's head towards, uh. Grimwood. I try not to die anymore. <laughs> Been. Been rough going. Cluster up for me. Um, at that point, I'll probably have started my next job, so it'll probably be more roguelikes and like single run games, excluding my hollow streams. I'll still do the horror games for October uh, and do the hollow streams. But beyond that, it's going to be probably smaller scale stuff. Uh, streaming will be cut back significantly, because I just don't think I'll have the time for it. Or the energy. So, these uh, playthroughs are kind of the last hurrah for streams of the channel. see more games like, I don't know, Slay the Spire, FTO, um, games that I've wanted to play on the channel, but with them being uh, roguelike in nature, I just kept putting them off. I like how they had a chance to do zero damage to 22 damage. What do they, what do they do? They have terrifying appearance. The unit's attacks apply a minus 20 uh, penalty to combat morale, a stacking 20 penalty. Okay. Robust. Oh, these are from uh, my other upgrades. So this is all they have. That's not the worst effect.
Yeah, I think it makes for better streams too, in case like you know you can't stream and follow up and like, if you're playing like a large narrative game. Like, I feel bad that I click through all the dialogue and stuff when I'm playing Pathfinder on a, on a stream, right? It doesn't feel right to me, but. It just, it makes more sense. Because the streams are more to, you know, get things done. I wouldn't be sad. I still have, what, seven more playthroughs to do after this one. But I'm going to do them all consecutively, so they'll get smoother as we go. And, in theory, uh, faster. Uh, Duskers, is it a roguelike? I have it on my wish list, or I may own it at this point. Not actually sure. But, uh, that's a planned let's play. You better stop it. All right, got ourselves another fortress. We still need to finish upgrading this one. All right, so we got the alchemist laboratory ready. Uh, we want the hospital, barracks, and archery range. Yes, one for each mythic path. But again, they'll get faster as we go. At least that's the the idea. Now, hopefully, I can knock them all out before I start this next job, because otherwise, it's going to be a very long endeavor. We got uh, Chainmail Dragonfly. This is another one that I, I think, used for a while on Camellia. Uh, this plus three chainmail can be activated once per day to grant all allies in a 30 foot radius a plus one insight uh, to attack and damage rolls against demons for 10 rounds. No, I had this on Arushalai, I think. Pretty good piece of equipment, though. No, no, it's just, uh,. There's a lot of hours involved, but very good job. Just gotta wait for the background check to finish. Then <laughs> I can actually start.
What, for Pathfinder? No. I just always wanted to do all experience all the mythic paths. I could do them on my own time. You know, push comes to shove, that's what I'll do, but... I've got a goal, and I'm gonna try and do it. Cause I don't know if any other content creators have done that. They may have. I have no idea. All right, Grimwood, here we come. Slowly but surely. They were great against our resolve. All right, so ideally, Hey, stop using fire spells against uh Run them through Am I doing it wrong? Hmm, okay, he's hold a monster against them, that's odd. Ow. Yeah, get out of here, you scallywag. Hey, gold dragon. Time for me to chase off that dragon. The goddess protects us. The world must be cleansed. Starting with my immediate vicinity. And again, we have to call that project quits. Depending on how quickly I get through the rest of them. Uh, yeah, no, get out of there. I'm gonna throw his poem in the fire. Sorry, buddy. But I'm romancing when do I get this playthrough? There will be, uh, one of the playthroughs will be a Let's Play. Once all the DLC have been released, I'm gonna do another big playthrough, probably after Rogue Trader is done. And, uh... Head on. I don't know, depending on circumstances, that might be it. Unfortunately. I'll still try to stream at least once on the weekends when I start this, uh, next career. But again, it'll be like one-shot stuff for the most part. But the weekends will be more devoted to uh, family time and stuff. Alright, uh, I guess we can map out some roads. Go this way and fight another demon army. What's up, buddy? Or buddies, I guess. Oh. 
All right, finally leveled up again. Uh, experienced Traveler. Uh, that's pretty good. So I like this. I think this is better since I only have the one army. And I only plan on really utilizing one army. I can use these other armies to start mapping out some of these other roads. That'd be the worst idea. It does keep beelining straight through the world wound to the all these armies. Yeah, I mean, I think it is objectively a better talent, but I'm fine with, uh... Ooh, just trying to utilize the one army. We'll see how it goes, though. This is a pretty tough fight. One less unit to worry about. Roughed up, that's okay. It all worked out. Now, I do usually prefer master maneuvers because I like having a big army. But I usually end up using the same few units. I mean, usually I add like hedge knights to the hell knights, and that's really it. I think I have the extra movement for the, the one army I'm going to have defending, having to go back and forth all the time. Also, I completely went past that army. <laughs> Whoops. That's okay. Alright, to Grimwood. This is what I set out to do in the very beginning of the stream, and we're just now getting there.
this waiting bores me. I will lend you my aid. Magritium Turinois. I'm losing my temper. I had to use haste last time. No reason to pause. You can trust me. Oh, is it out already? Uh, that kind of answers the question. <laughs> yeah, I didn't realize it was out already. Oh, for a month? Yeah. I don't I haven't really been keeping up with movies lately. I lead. You follow. Onwards! Oh, that's right. We have an ambush, and we have to wait. So all my buffs fall off anyway, don't they? Son of a gun. <laughs> That's all right. Let me help. How do I rub buffs up? All right, great. Move out. What's on your mind? I wonder. Yes. Together. Let's move we already. Stand. I will bring down the divine wrath. I will help where I can. Uh, do not. Do not waver.
Good job, team. After the Dargan. We finally, finally made it to Grimwood. Incoming army. Take care of this one first. Yeah, I enjoyed the first one. Just didn't keep up with the second. I saw the uh, trailers for it. Alright, so an unavoidable drill. Whenever the word of this plus three keen light pick attacks an enemy with DR, the DRs are decreased by one until the end of combat. That's not a terrible effect. Alright, so we have to intercept this other incoming army. Was it uh, this one? No, it's this guy. Oh, we've got time. I think we can head down this way first. We have a shortcut, do we? I have to come around that way, I think. Oh, that's fine. You shamans are strange. It's like you wield magic like clerics, but with strange spirits instead of gods. It makes me uneasy. What does it matter where the power comes from? What matters is it's on our side. She said calmly. <laughs> oh, the Artisan Sour. Hop it to skip this way. I don't have to go around, don't we? Alright, I don't know if I'm gonna go towards Gloomy Gorge or walk past it. I think we've got time to go this way. Hey, Duncast. Oh, we're running a little low in energy, aren't we? here. We're going to take out this army too. Let's keep the uh, the victory train rolling. I right, good. If ran forward, that doesn't matter because they're immune to fire damage anyway. Unlike these guys back here. Good old season of blue. Always a fun time. When my least favorite companion shows his true colors. All 
Climbability is pretty close. We'll go that route. A 29, we have 20 for both. Ability 27. Nice, we did it. <laughs> I mean, Setsuna may be the one doing most heavy lifting, but who chose Setsuna Shy at the beginning, right? Is it the employee or the employer who had the foresight to hire the employee? Alright, so I'm actually going to call the stream here. Uh, we're going to knock out this quest next time. Save the Storyteller. And then I think do Winter Sun next, because I want to get that Greatsword. And that will give my main character a nice little power spike. Now for this... I might save it for Arushalai still. That is a good effect. Yeah, we'll take care of this next time. And uh, try to do Winter Sun too. And I think that's if... Well, I also want to get Wolgif back. I haven't done that yet. But yeah, we'll save that for next time. I'll be streaming tomorrow on Monday, so... Hopefully things get a little bit more smoothly than this time. This is a, this is a rough stream, but it was fun. Darn solo fights, right? All right, everybody. Stay safe, stay classy, and I'll catch you on the flip side. Take care, everyone.